Good How are you? Uh, better than last Saturday. <laughs> How is this a confidence builder going into the bye week and then Cincinnati? Well, any time that you can come out and win a game. You know, I know uh, Kent State, a lot of people say, you know, inferior opponent, but you still have to come out and play the game. And uh, we came out and played, and uh, I think we improved from last week and a lot of positives. So, uh, you know, we, we got a lot of things to still improve upon, but that's what the bye week's for. But uh, I think the kids are seeing improvement, and that's what's important. Gunner, Gunner Keel put up six touchdowns in his last game. How, does, how are you going to prepare the secondary and the rest of the defense for uh, more aggressive. Uh, well, I, you know, I don't know. I haven't watched the game. I don't know what they've done. Uh, I saw the score, and uh, I know he's a good player, and they've got good uh, receiving core and all that stuff. But right now, I'm worried about uh, you know our players just getting better every single day throughout this bye week and enjoying the one we got today. Well, it, not just that, just the overall defense. You know, we had some mistakes last last week in the game uh, that uh, we've, we've talked about, but uh, we cleaned some of those things up. We weren't perfect today, but we played with good effort. We made plays. We got three interceptions. We uh, you know, got after the quarterback quite a bit, uh, didn't allow uh, many yards in the second half. So, uh, you know, they came out and they played four quarters. It was closer to a complete four quarters uh, than what we've played so far in the previous two. Uh, I saw a little bit of it when we were in the hotel, but no, I didn't see much of it. Uh, well, they look good for the little bit. It might might have seen you know a couple of series you know early on when they scored some points out of the gate. Did you guys discuss shutout? Or did you sense a hunger amongst the guys to get that? Uh, I think that any time you have an opportunity to get a shutout, the players want it, the coaches want it, you know, we all want it. And if it happened, great. You know we were going to get a lot of young players in there at the end of the game. And sometimes when you do that, you never know what happens. But uh, we wanted to make sure that the expectations were still the same, whether it's the ones, twos, or threes out there. And we walked away with a zero on the scoreboard, and that's a, always a great feeling. Chris, you said there was still some you know, more improvement that you need and want to see. How much, you know, further is there to go? Uh, it, you know, as a coach, you feel like you, you're never where you need to be. You know, so uh, every week we got to continue just to, to uh, uh, be to, uh, be better than Ohio State was the day before, and uh, that's really what our goal is right now. It's not about who we play, where we play. It's about us getting better every single day. And, uh, we did make improvement, but again, we got a long way to go in a lot of areas, and uh, we'll continue to, to work the process and keep going in the right direction.